gonna walk on this side, okay? Right there. Now, the fact that he moves off to the side as well, that I need to correct. Come on. Right, so again, I'm gonna I'm gonna be anticipating that he's gonna mm -hmm. ah, that's much better. That's okay. okay. So that's where he's always gonna be. And now 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 to intensify this a little bit, I can slow down a little bit and remind him that he has to follow my speed as well. Right? So there, now he gets to slow down right there. Ah, the top of the edge to move forward a little bit. Just a little, a little pop. And he clearly understands and backs off right there. Clearly understands, but your timing is what's making him it's making it clear because he's showing you that I'm good. You know, so if, if your timing is not right, it's really that you're not telling, telling him what to do. That's it. Come on. Now again, with the fit, I know that he's got his, his hand signals and all, but I kind of want to edge him away from that to a point where I could all just look at him, give him a hand signal, and he'll sit, or just look at him in a certain way and he'll sit. And that's what I want to eventually get him. I want to know. Every time, I, like, every time I stop, he has to sit. So I just sit. I'm just going to put a little bit of pressure here and down until he starts going down on himself, and I let him go up there. And as soon as he goes down, you relax a little bit. Now, even though he knows the, the other way, I, I, again, I want to try something different to kind of intensify the bond, because that's what it is. That's a bond that we're going to have. So he's, you know, alert, but he's not intense. Normally, other dogs that are, that are more aggressive, they hear this, and the ears, notice his ears come up, but not forward. So that's good. Alert is okay. Forward is already a psychological lunge, right? So he's kind of awesome, bro. Really? Yeah, man. This is great. Oh, you are. Parker. All right, so now. Okay.